Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and today we're back on the grind with some 2-5 cash games. Over here, calling big line with our 8-7 suited, going four ways to the flop. Ooh, pretty big flop for us here. Flop middle pair and a flush draw. Draw heavy board, four ways here. Checks all the way through, and now we turn the open-ended straight draw with our pair. Uh, going to go on a bet here. A lot of cards improve our hand. We want to start building the pot. It is interesting when we don't improve, though. So, like, this run out here, it's like, how do we proceed now? I think now we have to check. And it checks it down, and we lose to queen jack. All right, we got a hijack open here, a button flat. We're going to go for the squeeze out of the small blind with nines here. And get a call, two calls. Oh, buddy, here we go. All right. King, nine, four. So we flop middle sets. Put out the C-bet here. And see one call. And jack of spades on the turn. Going to be another one here where we just get a pretty miserable turn card. Uh, with that said, a three-bet pot, I think we're still definitely going for value. Calls three on the river. With a set here, obviously, like I said, the turn card is not great, but I think we can still get value from some two pair type in, so we are going to go for this here. Snap call. He has aces. He set the trap, and we get very lucky on the flop in what a nice size pot. So we do raise the jacks from the button here. Two calls from both the blinds. Get a flop 10, 5, 3, 2 diamonds. So we do have an over pair. Put out a C-bet. And we get a raise here with our over pair. Um, aces I like definitely want to just call here, because we're not. but there's going to be some bad turn cards here. I think we call, though. But kind of tempted to throw about that flop there. Um, seven of diamonds on the turn. So if you had the flush draw, it gets there. If you had four six, it gets there. Uh, with that said, he can still have like a top pair type hand. So I think we call one here and then evaluate river. Ace of clubs on the river. He checks. We're just going to check his down at this point. And ooh, we flopped a set of three. So good thing we did not put in the three bet on the flop. See? There's a low jack with kings. See two calls. A flop top set. Pretty uh, dynamic board here. So sometimes you'll slow play top set. Not against two opponents on this texture, though. Eight on the turn. So queen nine was already beating us. Pretty quick call. Five on the river. Trying to think if we want to give him a chance to bluff. I think we just value about here. Snap calls, and we are good with the kings. Let's see what he had. He had king five of spades. They so flop top pair, turn the flush draw, river two pair. So nice size pot. Raise a little jack, jack nine of clubs, get called by the big blinds. And when you raise jack nine of clubs, this is the type of board we got in mind. Uh, do we just call a raise? I think we're going to go with a raise here at the flush. Pretty quick call. Uh, jack on the turn. Pick up top pair. Not that it matters at this point. Not that that's what we're going for. Continue going for some value. Clicks it. <laughs> um, I mean, the way he's played this is super strong. We're just not following the jack high flush. Uh, he has his beat, he has his beat. I think we just need to get this in because we're not going to love a club on the river. Also, the board pairs, we cannot love it. So we're just going to get this in now here. Don't think he's folding very often, but... And he's going to have a smaller flush. Huge for us there. And we do avoid the... He had a gutter to the straight flush, and uh, we win a nice pot with a cooler there. Button open here, we three bet the small blind. Big blind snap calls, and we're gonna go three ways to a flop here. Nine, eight, eight. 
Go ahead and bet here. So the flush draw is less value on a paired board, but still valuable nonetheless. And we are going to go with the double barrel. He calls pretty quick. Hit the river here. And going to go for the value. Snap calls in. We're good. A good size pot going our way with the river ace high flush. Our opponent had the king ten of clubs. Wow. Nut flush over second flush. Raise a cutoff here. Ace jack suited. I'm going to do some mix of checking and c betting here we'll bet at this time. Takes a bit of time and calls. Ace on the turn, we're going to go for some value here. Calls pretty quick. Uh, six on the river. I think we do still go for value. We don't beat worse ace highs or worse aces now because like the queen chops it, which is kind of unfortunate. Uh, when he calls turn, I don't expect to have tons of six x. Ah, uh, jeez, he just raises. Uh, I mean, I'm really tempted to call because there's some draws that miss with the hearts that he could raise here. And we don't block the heart draws ace turning into a bluff. Uh, and again, I don't know if he necessarily has tons of sixes calling that turn. Um, ace queen, I expect a three bet pre some frequency. He could have sets of threes. Um, man, I feel like I'm just talking myself towards a call here. It's a huge sizing, and it's like one of these things where it's like I don't know if people find bluffs enough, but like this feels like it could be a spot where he's just deciding to attack us because we probably don't have as much 6x. So I'm going to call this. And he does have queen 10, so we're good. All right, so see a open from the cutoff button flat. We squeeze with the nines. I'm gonna check on ace, jack, jack. Uh, we can definitely have some aces when we check here. So I don't think he can necessarily just go blasting off here. And he does decide on a check. Deuce on the turn will check again. And ugh, ugly river. Get counterfeited. And gonna try and steal this here. Make sure he doesn't get to see it with like a king or queen high. Uh, we definitely play this exactly like we have an ace, so. Don't expect him to fold an ace or jack, obviously, but everything else, I think he can hold it, fold it pretty high frequency there. Hijack open here, going to three bet the ace king suited. Get called pretty quick. 10 5 deuce. Going to go ahead and put out a bet. See a call. Four of clubs on the turn. So the question here is do we bet or do we check? Lots of outs here. I'm actually going to check. So some of our really good draws, I like checking back sometimes. Don't want to get blown off equity. Uh, so we're going to check. And boom, on the river, back to our nut flush. He checks. And going to go for some value. And he calls, and we are good with the ace high flush. See what he had. He had pocket eights with a club. That's going to wrap up the cash game session for today. So we played for three hours and played mostly at 2-5 where we played 786 hands at a profit of $1,899. Also played a little bit of 1-2. We played 87 hands at a profit of $130. Total profit on the day at $2,030. Feels good to book a big win today after a bit of a rough patch recently. So if you guys are watching the vlog on YouTube today, enjoyed the video, please be sure to like the video as well as comment and subscribe to the channel. And if you ever want to my live streaming schedule, I post it every Monday morning at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on my Twitch schedule tape page.